that what makes me happy to uh, to wake up the morning of a race to know that I'm going to go racing and uh, and that uh, you only have uh, two outcomes, either a good one or a bad one. The duels are a lot of fun. Semi-finals then, Vern and Van Dorn going head to head against one another. Two drivers, one flying lap, and winner takes all stakes. Very impressive there for Stoffel Van Dorn. It is completely 50-50 on the predictor as well. Out of turn 11 and across on, the timing line we go for Van Dorn. Is it going to be pole? No! Two thousandths of a second! Just missed out on the pole position by two thousand, so super close, but Stoffel ended up P2 and uh, Jeb P3. All five lights are on then, the Sao Paulo E3. It's time for a Samba as we go racing and get underway. Van Dorn into second, third place there is Mitch Evans, just gets ahead. Come on, Stoffel. Nick Cassidy, though, is trying to get outside of Stoffel Van Dorn. You know, sometimes being overtaken is part of the game in Formula E. It obviously depends at what stage of the race it is. Unfortunately, not, not the race we hoped for. Hopefully we can uh, learn from that and uh, move forward to the next one.